Hey guys, my name is Carly Hartman. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to have you here again this week. So in honor of Thanksgiving and love, friendship, thankfulness, I want to do a video titled Love Yourself um, to kind of show to be confident on the inside and the outside. For example, that's why I'm not wearing any makeup, nor did I do my hair for this video on purpose to show you that even I can do it. So stay tuned to hear some tips. Okay, so growing up obviously in high school was a very big part of my life where I was trying to figure out who I was. A lot of people do that, you know, and so my years were definitely freshman and sophomore year when I was trying to figure out like what kind of person I was. Was I going to be a flirtatious and mysterious girl or was it going to be super outgoing, crazy, energetic? Um, obviously sophomore year I figured out my real personality and that's this, being outgoing and super energetic. So. Um, that was really, really cool for me. Some people, it takes a little bit longer to figure out who you are, but other people, you know, you figure it out right away. And so I just wanted to encourage you that, you know what, I never had to change, like, my personality around different people that I was around, you know, different groups. I just ma maintain my same personality around every single person, and that's really about loving yourself and loving who you are. Because um, if you are shy about that, and you're like insecure about that, then you're gonna be different around every different group of people. So my challenge to you is to really, you know, love who you are on the inside, um, your passions and dreams, and really bring that out in, you know, to inspire other people around you because people around you need to hear about how you wanna change the world. That's so important to them because a lot of times we can be super caught up in like right now in our little world where we have to be, you know, you have to hear what other people are experiencing and other people are inspired by. So really be that person to be a light in someone else's life because you could encourage them to be who they are too. And that'd be super, super awesome. Also, another big thing on my heart would have to be for people that are a little bit older, especially older women. You know, whenever you talk to an older woman, sometimes like, oh, how old are you? And they're like, oh, I'm not gonna tell you, you don't wanna know, I'm, I'm 35, ha 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 ha. You know, and when people say that, that's totally fine, then it's up to you. And I know you might be thinking it's funny since I'm like so young and telling you this advice. But just know that when you tell young people like me your age, that really like establishes your credibility and it really makes us want to learn from you, your wisdom and knowledge that you gain through life. So just know that every single wrinkle that you may have, every single gray hair, hey, I have gray hairs too, don't feel like you're alone. Um, that's all kind of like a little simple of like all the wisdom and knowledge that you've gained over the years that you need to teach the younger generation. So just know to be empowered with your outward appearance. Like don't be upset about that. Don't try to use anti-aging cream to do that because I just know that when I'm going to be older, um, I'm definitely going to be embracing it and telling everyone, do you know how old I am? I just hope that that encourages you too. So that way I can kind of hit the younger crowd with the high school story and the older crowd with the wrinkles story because you're beautiful, seriously. I don't have to be the one to tell you that. I'm sure you know that too because it's what's in your heart that really matters. Um, how you wanna change the world, how you just wanna spread love everywhere you go, that's really what matters. And especially with girls, I know sometimes you get upset because boys like, they're like, oh my gosh, I have to look beautiful to have a guy like me. You know, that's honestly not true. And if that is true for the guy that you are, you know, have the hots for, then he's not the guy for you because the guy for you is the one that should be looking on the inside, not on the outside. I just want you to know to stop comparing yourself to Instagram photos and media photos because that is seriously not like someone's real life. It could be photoshopped, it could be tons of filters on it. So just know that, you know, being who you are, you're not gonna wanna be anyone else or compare yourself to anyone else because that's gonna be enough for you. So I really hope that encourages you this week. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and have a wonderful Thanksgiving. I'll definitely tell you that next week again because it's not Thanksgiving yet, Carly. Don't be too excited. I hope you just really, you know, embrace this whole season of thankfulness and love. And also please just don't, you know, th be thankful for things on Thanksgiving. Be thankful for things every single day because your life is beautiful because you're in it. Thank you so much and I'll see you next week. Have a wonderful rest of your day, night, week, month, year. You know the drill. Okay, love you. Bye.